Big congratulations to Ted Haynes and Calvin Call for taking home top spot at the Emo Walleye Classic. For everything else going around the district, stay tuned to this episode of Around Town. Jody Brown took home top spot during Emo Walleye Classic's Wall Idol singing contest. Tony Labby was deemed the People's Choice winner and also took home third place, and Brittany Hayes rounded out the trio, placing second. All Wall Idol performances can be found posted under local events on Fort Francis TV. Saturday night brought on a big crowd to Fort High. With the school year winding down, hundreds of onlookers filled the theater and cafeteria to watch couples parade during the Grand March ceremony for prom. And both Muskie soccer teams are headed to Offsa this week, with the girls headed to Kenora and the boys to Hamilton. We've been saying since day one, it's who wins, uh, who wins on the last day, right? And uh, so when we knew that we weren't going to finish first, then it was about peaking at the right time, and uh, I think the guys really did that. Everyone's hoping for nice weather this coming up weekend. This weekend we got highs of 15 and 16 on Saturday and Sunday. Hopefully the weather stays good for the second annual Dandelion Festival held on Sunday at 1 o'clock at Lion Clubs Park. If you're looking for more to do in the coming weeks, there are still tickets available for the Marianas Trench Concert on June 12th. On June 20th, the folks organizing the first annual Fort Francis Folk Festival are holding a fundraiser at the Heavy Metal Exhibit at the museum. The event is an open mic session and organizers are hoping to get some local talent out. Cost to attend the event is $3. This is Andrew George for Fort Francis TV and you just went around town.